Alright folks, I'm back. Uh, sorry for the long hiatus, but uh, I just ran out of enthusiasm and uh, stuff to record on. So uh, let's just get this over. This video's name is uh, Review in the Past Month, so let's get this over with. Now, you see right here, I made this at the shop of my school. It's the present Philadelphia 76ers court. I mean, you might say it sucked, but I... I tried my best, you know, and uh, to me, I think it's pretty sweet. Now, we're moving on. So, on the first day of spring break, Canada, they call it March break, I bought the WWE World Heavyweight Belt that Mattel makes right now. And trust me, you've seen a lot of uh, reviews of the belt, but this is what the belt looks like in my view. Shiny, I added a cardboard nameplate, and there's some more gold. I didn't put the Velcro on it because it's like so valuable to me. It's like the real stuff. Now, you've seen me make a lot of belts during the past few weeks. For example, the Hogan 85 belt, United States belt, the WW Intercontinental belt, and the full-size Intercontinental belt that's used right now. And I did a paint job on it so far. Here's what it looks like. I added some paint to it. Because color pencils don't work out. And when you're half in the bag, your problems don't feel like anything. Yeah, so that's the paint job. And now the final step before I sign off for a while is I have made another wing eagle belt. Which I call the white strap WW championship now let's look at this of course the white stuff is made of vinyl once again I added a gold tip you know out of cardboard I got spray paint and I printed out all the plates I put it up to full length adult size so it's the same length as the adult size belt and once again I'll add snap-ons to it later but for now this is what I have y'all soon or later you will see Uploaded videos of my wrestling promotion, KCW. Even though it says Kids WWE and Kids WCW, I'm not trying to get in trouble by the real company. So I'm just plastering that out right now. So uh, that's all I have, and uh, peace out. Rock and roll forever.